explain the gas system to your Logan coach living quarter. Located underneath the deck are your propane tanks. Here are your propane tanks. Is a regulator. The regulator used on this trailer and on our living quarter trailers has a selector switch to select one of the two tanks. This selector switch must be switched to the tank in order to release gas. So in this case, the arrow is pointing to this tank here. And you can tell that it's not full because it's red. If it were full, it would be a dark color. After this tank has gone through all of its gas, you're going to have to come out here and manually switch to your other tank. The propane system on your Logan Coach living quarters operates your water heater, your furnace, your cooktop, as well as your fridge. First, water heater. In order to turn your water heater on, simply locate the water heater switch and turn it to the on position. A light will appear and your water heater will ignite. It's going to cycle and you're going to hear clicking until it does light. Once it does light, this light's going to stay on until your, uh, your water is at, a, is at the level that it needs to be hot. You can leave this switch in the on position and it's not going to constantly use your gas. Every time the thermostat notices that it gets below the certain temperature, it will turn back on. Next, your cooktop. Your cooktop on most trailers is located underneath this flat surface. What we'll do is we'll just raise it. We'll lock this mechanism into place that will keep this upright. In order to use your cooktop, we'll just put this valve into the light position and we'll take a lighter and light it. Next, your fridge. The fridge will run off of both 110 power or gas. The fridge has an on off switch right here which we'll put in the on position. It also has an auto selector switch which allows the fridge to determine whether it has gas or electricity. If the fridge senses electricity, electricity it will shut the gas off and use the electricity. When you unplug your trailer from shoreline power or from generator power, it will automatically switch the fridge back over to gas. If I push this button in, it's on the automatic setting. If you want to change that setting from automatic and strictly use your gas, you'll just push that button in and you'll be able to hear it click until it notices that you have no electricity and it lights. Finally, your furnace. The furnace is operated simply by this thermostat. You just put this thermostat into a warmer position. It's going to automatically turn the blower on your furnace and you will hear a clicking until your furnace ignites. Once this thermostat reaches the desired temperature, it's going to automatically shut off. Anytime that it gets below that temperature, it will restart. If I want to turn the thermostat off, I'll simply put it in the back position and it's going to take a few moments before that fan turns off. Thanks for watching this today. And thank you for having an interest in a local coach living quarter horse trailer. If you have any questions, please visit us at our website, www.logancoach.com. Or look us up on Pinterest, Facebook, or YouTube.